hey guys welcome back to my channel hi my name is Sam if you are new in today's video I'm gonna be sharing another new to me recipe and that is for orange chicken now I love orange chicken when we go out for date night and we go to an Asian restaurant this is one of the few that I get when I go to an Asian restaurant it's absolutely delicious so we're gonna be making that today um, I'm also going to be making a double batch of rice because we're going to serve rice alongside and I'm also going to make a um, kind of like a California roll sushi type thing. So it's going to be absolutely delicious. I will leave the link to this recipe down in the description box below as well as pinned in the comment section. I will also leave my blog pinned in the comment section as well so you can find both of those there. So. Let me show you everything that you're gonna need and we'll get this going. I cannot wait to try this recipe. It smells absolutely delicious. So let me take you back and show you how I made it. Okay guys, for this recipe, this is everything that you are gonna need. It's super, super simple. Like I said, I found this recipe on Pinterest. I will leave that link down below in the description box below as well as pinned in the comment section so what you're going to need is you're going to need some chicken you can use chicken breast chicken thighs um, tenderloins whatever you have on hand is fine i've just got some chicken thighs that i've cubed up and put just put them in a bowl here i've got some orange marmalade i've got some barbecue sauce i don't have much in this um container so I'm gonna have to open another one got some soy sauce some oil and some salt and pepper so let me get you guys set up and we'll get this going because I am super super excited to try this while this is cooking I'm also going to make some rice I'm gonna chop up some green onions and get out some sesame seeds for the topping I'm also going to make some sushi to go along with this so let's get this going okay guys so I've got everything set out here ready to go I am just going to open this extra bottle of barbecue sauce I'm going to start off with the chicken I'm just going to add the chicken right into the crock pot along with some oil just a little bit just enough to coat so it doesn't stick to the bottom of the crock pot a little bit of pepper a little bit of salt and now we're just going to give this a little mix here just to get it coated in that oil. Okay, now we're going to add in our um, marmalade. Get it broke up a little bit. I think I got it all out. Get rid of that. And I'm going to add in my barbecue sauce. Now you can use whatever kind of barbecue sauce that you like. Um, I like uh, Stubbs. This brand is really good. I'm also going to add in my soy sauce. And we are going to give this a mix. Make sure it's nice and well combined. One thing I like about crock pot recipes is I get to try new recipes all the time and most of them are absolutely delicious. We have had a few misses in the past, um, but just like anybody else, you kind of find some that you like, keep into your rotation and then there's some that just doesn't fit you and your family but we're gonna try this today and it smells absolutely delicious cannot wait 
I'm going to put the lid on. We're going to cook this for about three hours on high. And I will see you guys back when this is done. In the meantime, like I said, I'm going to make some rice, chop some green onions, get out some cel uh, some celery. No, no, Sam. We're going to get out some sesame seeds. And we are going to chop up some vegetables and stuff for some sushi. And I will see you back when this is done. Okay guys, this has been cooking for about three hours. I've checked the chicken and it's completely cooked through. It's a little bit more liquidy than what I would imagine it to be. So I think I'm going to make up a cornstarch slurry and put in there and let it cook for about 10 minutes and I think it'll be good. I've got my rice sitting over here to the side. I've got my sushi in the refrigerator getting nice and cold so I'm going to do that and then I will meet you back here and we'll plate it up and taste it. Hey guys so I've got everything plated up I've got some broccoli heating up on the stove back here um, it should be done in just a few minutes don't mind my hair and I'm a little 
red because I've been outside all day and I'm absolutely loving the sun. I am just, I'm a summertime girl. I am loving it. So, I've got my plate here. I've just got some rice, some chicken, and a little bit of sushi. Um, uh, the California roll that I made. And I am so ready to try this. I'm going to get a little bit of the chicken and the rice. It's so hot, but it smells absolutely delicious. Mmm. Mm-hmm. That is so good. I absolutely love trying new recipes. Um, like I said, this is a new recipe to me or to us. This is our first time trying it and it's really, really good. I highly recommend it, trying it. I will leave the link for um, the recipe for the orange chicken down in the description box below. So you guys can find that. It's also pinned in the comment section. All right, guys, that is going to wrap up today's video. If you guys enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe before you leave. And as always, you can find all of the information for this video down in the description box below as pinned in the comments section. You can find links to recipes. You can find the link to my blog and any other of my social medias right down there in the description box. So we're going to go enjoy some dinner, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.